Our goal, I think, is always to increase numbers, um, but it's also to retain those that we do have. So it's kind of a twofold goal. We want to keep the ones that are here and keep them happy and coming back and just doing the service and going out. But we also want to bring in new people because we are trying to be more diverse and having that inclusion is so awesome because then we have new sites we'll go to and new people we'll meet. And it's just really cool to see that play out on trips as well. So there will be times where you're doing service, usually in the morning, afternoon sort of thing. And then you'll have a little break in between, go home, eat, stuff like that, relax. So it's not so bad, like where you're not getting that same relaxation as you would somewhere else. You're just getting it in a different way because service is kind of just a breather. You are doing something that doesn't involve yourself. And it's that giving back and just caring for someone else instead of thinking about yourself constantly. It's a really great way to meet people, whereas on a normal break, you're just kind of with people you already know. So experience a new community as well. Um, you get to travel and you get to see kind of out bigger than just like our own little bubble that we're in. Each student is paying $200 to go on the trip. And then site leaders only pay $100. We're not only like asking for students for the $200 up front for the trip, we also have to have every student sending out like 20 different letters to relatives or friends mm -hmm. um, asking for money, asking for funds for the trip wow. because that alone, the $200 per student is not enough. You're just really standing out when you enter that community mm -hmm. and, but like you have to keep reminding yourself like you're there to learn, you're being invited mm -hmm. because if you, if you come in mm -hmm. with I'm this privileged person. Mm -hmm. Look what I can do for all these people. Mm -hmm. Like you're not like you're not a hero. That's something that I had to really learn my first time because I've never been in an experience like that before. Mm -hmm.